So this is a bit of an interesting one. I was cruising around on YouTube as I normally do sometimes and I come across this video by W2NDG and just uh, have a look at this. That's receiving single sideband on a Quan Chang UVK5. So that's receiving on 17 meters. So what I thought I'd do is I'd do a bit of research into this. Well, I'll put the link in the description below, but basically this is a link to Telegram. It's a channel here that details all of the um, changes that they've been doing, some modifications. And one of the modifications that someone's been doing is spectrum analyzer changes and also being ha given the opportunity to receive AM on any frequency, but not only that, also single sideband as well. Now, this page is in Russian, so you do have to go and translate it. And there's also a GitHub here, which has got all of the modifications with the different firmwares as well. The only problem that I found was that I tried this and I couldn't get it to receive on sideband properly, at least not according to that video. So I'm kind of asking you guys out there is if you've tried this before or you know much about it, how have you got it to manage to receive properly? Because there's all of these different, uh, and, and I don't understand a lot of it, what's happening here, but there's all these steps and bandwidths and everything. And I've tried to set it accordingly, but I just can't get it to go. So I loaded this firmware up in my K6. It loads up just like normal like that. You need to open up the squelch or turn on the monitor mode of the radio. And then you need to press F5 and that gets you into this mode. And at the moment you can see that it's on FM. If I press the zero or FM button, that will then change my modes. There's AM and there's USB. Now, if I press PTT, this gets me into my tuning mode and I can tune up and down the frequencies or the frequency bands as I uh, wish. As I said, I'm a little bit confused as to some of the functions. It can be a little bit um, convoluted and a little bit confusing. Also, my radio hasn't successfully decoded an awful lot of, U of SSB. I did it on two meters to my radio and I could hear myself. It sounded a little bit funny. So I wonder if you've played around with it yourself. Perhaps you have. Let me know in the comments below. I have my antenna connected up at the moment and I'm just, it's a little bit slow to tune. I think if you put it back into FM mode, it tunes a little bit quicker. So if I go to the... FT8 frequency on 18.1, then I can't really hear anything there. And I know that 17 meters is open at the moment. So maybe it's just my settings. So if you know what I'm doing wrong, let me know in the comments. But I thought this was interesting to have a bit of a play around with. For those who want to check out the firmware again, it's linked below. So have a bit of a crack, have a bit of a play around with it because uh, this would be a cool little receiver for uh, single sideband if you could get it to go which obviously according to that video you can if you want to learn more about this radio then there are some links to some videos right here that you can check out including reviews how to do more modifications to this radio uh, pretty versatile cheap little unit